test one two three okay a record hi guys welcome to another blender tutorial if you're a new subscriber i upload blender tutorials today i'm gonna show you some stupid animation stuff very shitty tutorial it's gonna be okay i don't have time to figure out some complicated procedural uh, shaders whatever yeah maybe you're gonna learn something if you're a beginner if not i'm sorry that i waste your fucking time whatever i am in blender i'm gonna select this cube by the left click G Y and move this by here. Shift A on the curve. I'm gonna choose this sphere zone Bezier or whatever it's called. And I'm gonna select this. Okay, go to the object right here and convert to mesh. Go to the modifier stop right here on this icon. Select this. Click right here and choose this scene modifier or whatever it's called. One above. Uh, skin modifier scene I think it's called because I see shit it's late I have this effect I'm gonna just click right here and drag this to my fucking cube and I have this effect as you can see and basically I can adjust right here yes this kind of angle that I create and this basically duplicate this stuff as you can see yes I have this kind of spherical shit. If you wanna adjust the space between this stuff, just select your cube and move this. G Y, I'm gonna move this and I have, yes, this kind of like effect. And I can create this bigger, as you can see. Now, um, I'm gonna just select this stupid stuff. Maybe a little bit adjust the angle radius right here and I'm gonna click apply so go right here and click apply I'm gonna delete this cube so select this by the left click X and delete and you can add whatever object you want maybe I'm gonna choose some kind of fucking train uh, and and I'm gonna open this free only if you don't have this blender it uh, just go to the edit preferences and on the add-ons just search for the blender kit and select and you have free 3d models now I add this fucking train I think and I'm gonna scale this train by the S and move the mouse now I'm gonna bring this to scene right here on this uh, tab Boom. And I'm gonna go select this fucking train, go to this modifier, and I'm gonna add curve modifier. And basically, I'm gonna duplicate this, so shift D and left click, go to the object, convert to curve. I'm gonna select my fucking train where is this train okay and on this uh, curve I'm gonna select my curve that I create uh, I'm gonna maybe scale this train a little bit because I see fucking shit wait guys because my mouse is here is this train I'm gonna not this fuck my mouse this select this train S and move the mouse and basically if I'm gonna go to this tab and just move on this direction wait guys what is going on i don't add this modifier to this curve i'm sorry guys i'm gonna s once again go to the curve and select my fucking curve and i'm gonna go right here and if i'm gonna move this basically travel on this fucking curve yes but you must adjust the of course I'm gonna adjust the rotation on this stuff something like this and I can animate this path basically this curve modifier is using to curve to uh, adjust the shape of the models but you can use this to to you know travel on this curve like I created right here it's shitty but you can do this as you can see this fucking travel on this stuff yeah let's go and of course I can uh, I can add a keyframe yes to this so 
wait guys because my mouse is broken like my pc and my fucking life uh maybe i'm gonna cl create a fucking keyframe right here and i'm gonna move this yeah it's travel on this fucking shit right here maybe and um, i'm gonna move this on the timeline so go on this tab if you want to create and change the location okay and click right here and this little icon pop up and move this on the timeline you're gonna have faster or whatever if i'm gonna bring this i'm gonna have faster yes this travel fucking fast we let's go yeah basically like i said this modifier doesn't it, it's not used uh, fuck my english uh, this modifier is not used to this but you can use this you know to create this stupid animation and of course you can add why we duplicate uh, this and create a curve and a mesh because you can add some materials to this stuff yes you can add uh, you can add some materials maybe you can add some modifier to this maybe wireframe or whatever so yeah this is the tutorial guys i know it's shitty but i need content like i said at the beginning this tutorial gonna be shit i'm assuming you know how to add some materials or whatever so yeah this is this fucking tutorial it's shit but maybe you're gonna use this in some cool way because as you can see this fucking travel this stuff is yes? and i can travel on my fucking camera yeah train is maybe you can add another model and animate uh, key create a fucking keyframe to you know make this kind of sequence uh, chasing sequence like maybe your cube gonna chase in this fucking train whatever shitty tutorial but i need some content stay tuned for another tutorials because i'm gonna weekend i'm gonna have and i'm gonna have you know some more time to so i'm gonna figure out some complicated stuff and cooler shit thank you for watching uh, if i'm worth your time sorry guys but whatever see you on the next video